Hey everyone, I'm Joel on the road and today my UNESCO World Heritage Journey is at the four canal lifts of the Canal de Centre in Belgium. In the 19th century, this was coal mining country and coal mining country requires a lot of transportation. In the age before steam, Canals were the obvious solution, but to connect this area to existing canals, they had to overcome a height difference of more than 60 metres. That would require a huge number of locks, which would slow all their boats down, so they opted instead for hydraulic boat lifts, like the one that you can see behind me. Let's go and take a closer look. Now the principle behind these lifts is actually very simple, it's just displacement. Because the two lifts are balancing each other out, sitting on columns in pools of water. You flood one pool of water, raising one up, and the other one goes down at the same time. So you have one at the top, boat goes in, you flood water, and they balance each other out, lowering the boat. I find it really interesting that something of this size actually requires very little machinery. There's only a few water pumps to keep things moving in and out, otherwise these huge things behind me literally just move themselves. But despite this system being so simple yet ingenious, it was actually only used quite rarely. There were only eight of them ever built and four of them are on this canal. So the canals and the lifts were used for almost a hundred years until they were replaced by the one gigantic lift that you can see behind me. It traverses the entire 70 metre height in one go with one lift. It's not part of the World Heritage Site, but I think it is an important part of the story. But that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm Joel on the road, and I'll see you at the next World Heritage Site.